Welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Today I'm going to show you a creamy burrito casserole. The amounts of the ingredients that you're going to need to make the casserole will be listed in the information box below or you can find it on the website or my Roku channel. To make the casserole you'll need some chopped onions, a pound of ground beef or you could use ground turkey, you will need some taco seasoning mix, and I got the low sodium, but you can use what you want. Some uh, refried beans, and I'm using spicy refried beans, but again, you can use whatever kind you want. You'll need two to three cups of shredded cheese. You could use the Mexican cheese, the cheddar cheese, or whatever is your preference. You'll need a can of cream of mushroom soup. You'll need some sour cream, and you'll need six large flour tortillas. You also are going to need to preheat your oven to 350 degrees and you will need to spray a casserole dish with cooking spray. To start this casserole, I put my ground beef and onion in this skillet and I'm going to brown my ground beef along with the onion. And then after that's done, if I need to, I'll drain it. This is lean ground beef, so I'm not sure I'm going to need to do that but that would be the time to do it. So I'm just gonna get this all nice and brown and then we'll move on to the next step. My ground beef and onion are all nicely browned and the onion is uh, cooked. So now I'm going to show you what I'm going to do next. Okay, so to the ground beef and the onions, I'm going to add my refried beans. All out of there. And according to what kind of beans that you decide to use, you can make this a little bit spicier or a little milder, depending if you have children that don't like the spice. This, we like spice, so I got the spicy ones. And I'm going to add my taco seasoning. And I'm just going to stir this all together. That's all mixed together. And the next thing I'm going to do is take a bowl and put my cream of mushroom soup and my sour cream in it and mix that together. sour cream. I'm just going to mix this until it's all blended well together. That looks pretty good. So now we're ready to assemble the casserole. To start assembling this casserole, I'm going to put half of this sour cream and mushroom soup mixture on the bottom of this casserole and I'm just going to spread it all over the bottom. Just get it spread out as evenly as you can. A little bit more. And then I'm going to take three of the flour tortillas and I'm just going to start tearing them and laying them on top of that mixture. They don't have to be pretty. to continue on till I've done three of them. This is a quick dinner that you could get on the table if you're in a hurry to do so for whatever activities that your children might be out and involved in. Okay, now we're going to put half of our meat mixture on top of that. Spread it out. Do the best you can, getting it even. And then we're going to put half of our shredded cheese on top. And now I'm going to make another layer exactly like the first one. So we're going to start with our mushroom mixture. It'll be a little bit harder to spread it on top of the shredded cheese, but we'll just do the best we can. Let's try to get it all covered. And the next step is to tear three more of these flour tortillas on top. And 
Now I'm going to put the rest of my meat mixture on. put this in my 350 degree preheated oven for 20 to 30 minutes. My casserole cooked for 30 minutes and I just took it out of the oven and this is what it looks like and now I'm going to cut a piece and put it on a plate and show you what it looks like on a plate. Always the hardest to get out. This is what it looks like on a plate. This is creamy burrito casserole. I hope you enjoy it.